This video is another look at this concept that we looked at called special products and how we find these special product results. So I'm going to assume here that you understand the square of a sum is a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. That the square of a difference is a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. And the product of a sum and a difference is a squared minus b squared. Now, in order to do these multiplications, I like to say this pattern out loud in my head. First thing I notice is this is a sum, because of that plus, of a square, or the square of a sum. Okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to square the first term plus 2 times the first term times the last term plus square the last term. Now, this is a shortcut to helping us do these multiplications. When I do that, I get 49x squared plus 28x plus 4. I can always go back and multiply, write it out as 7x plus 2 times 7x plus 2, and multiply those binomials using binomial multiplication. All right, another shortcut is called the square of a difference. I have a square and a subtraction. This is telling me that this is a square of a difference. To do this, I'm going to take the first term and square it, minus 2 times the first term times the last term. Now notice how it's just that 4. We already took care of the negative sign. And then plus a square of the last term, which would be 4 squared. 3x squared would be 9x squared. All right, minus, let's see, that's 6 times 4 minus 24x plus 16. And the last one, the product of a sum and a difference. Now notice how the first terms are the same. The last terms are the same, but the difference comes where one's a plot positive and one's a negative, or it's addition and a subtraction. This is another special case called the product of a sum and a difference. When this occurs, all that I have to do is take the first term, square it, minus the second term, or the last term, and square it. This gives me 81x squared minus 16, and that's a special product. Remember, again, you can always resort back to binomial multiplication to help with these things. Good luck and let me know if you have any questions.